I'm back at it again. A buck five, that bang guy. My last video was the worst. This one's gonna be stepping in a different direction and give you the best. I'm gonna tell you, this is one of the best arrangements I've heard, I, I wanna say in, in a few years, actually. And it's by Alabama and m And it's that Kim, when love calls, they put their own spin to it and made it a little more complicated than the original version, which I think is always great for a writer to do. So it's just an awesome from compilation of, of great stuff all in one song. Got a melodic overtone. It's got a lot of different rest in places to make it uh, up and down beat pop of the drum. Arpeggio, pentatonic scales. It's got everything you can imagine all in one piece. And they execute it great. Telling you, it's one of the best. So if you've seen it, you know what I'm talking about. But if you hadn't, you in for a treat. All right, let's get to it. I want to give a shout out to Killer Kev, man. You always come with that cinematic view. You right there in the action. And this is about the 50th time I done heard this song. Just the overall movement of it in general. And shout out to the Dancing Divas, too. They're going to do their thing. Woo! Go on, trumpets. You heard that glitch up into this? <laughs> Big band sound, man. Big band sound. Them trumpets playing them 30 second notes. Ah. Uh, uh. Okay. Oh, I love that little move. Wow, that was, she did that. She did that. Now they doing that round robin. And they all got their own little style to it. That's what I love too. Another thing, man, these dances, they come in with them, they come in with these real dances, not just them regular eight counts now. They really put some effort in. I love it, man. They're going to give the stingets, the dancing dolls, all of them around for their money. These girls are truly elegant. Go Divas. I like that little side step. This is a perfect marriage of, of song and dancers. Oh, you did that. Crisp. I love this version. They they complicated the, the whole tone and I love it so much. Go on 30 seconds, come up and down that, that scale. <laughs> oh, you heard that silence for a beating the half and then that drum kick on the back end of that, on that, that down note. Oh, amazing writing. Go on, Bones. I hear you. Oh, so the phones, they got everybody carrying their melody so, so perfect. Great balance. Go on, through the phones. They grabbing their little feet. What they gonna do with them fans? Uh-huh. Nice. Uh, Y'all see, man, it's the best arrangement of 2021. You agree, don't you? I told you it was the truth. I mean, it's the best arrangement to me I've heard in a long time, honestly. I know you got to agree because they had all that melodic surprise in there, man. They were all in tone. It's like each section played masterfully executed 
all of the phrasing and just the overall bars and how they presented them. Those 30 second notes that the trumpets came in on, the, the actual breaks and then the drum kick, you know, on the downbeat. It was just, everything about it was great. And that's why it's my number one arrangement of 2021 HBCU uh, band season. Hey, give this a thumbs up. Hey, like it. Because it was definitely worth liking. And also subscribe and comment. You know, I'm down for that. So I'm glad you stopped by. Until the next time I say hi, I'm Buck Five, that band guy.